Kerala, one of India's most popular holiday destinations. In a bid to attract more foreign visitors, officials are striving to create a cleaner environment. And with the support of a local businessman, many of its residents are helping by turning their household waste into sustainable energy. In Kerala's capital, Trivandrum, a company called Biotech is equipping homes and businesses with the means to produce their own sustainable energy from waste. Traditionally in India, food waste is dropped on the ground, where it is eaten by birds and animals. But in the cities, this is becoming less acceptable. Not only does it cause smells, the rotting debris also attracts rats. Biotech owner Saji Das is trying to solve this problem and save homeowners money by reducing their fuel bills. Our main program is by implementation, research and development of biogas program. On the same time, the main headache is waste disposal. Everybody is looking for the, uh, a better remedy. This was one problem that was bothering us when we came here. How would we dispose of our uh, waste? And when we got this, in fact, it came as a blessing. Very, very <laughs> convenient way of disposing our waste without any headache. Liquid petroleum gas, or LPG, is the most common source of cooking fuel and costs about 100 rupees, or one pound a week. But by installing a biogas tank in their home, residents like Sahadavan can save money and help clean up the environment. No smell, no mess. We are very, very happy with it and we just hope that more people would go about installing this. Because it not only keeps the place, the environment clean, it gives us gas as well as fertilizer. There are two domestic versions. One permanent, the other portable, both based on the same simple technology. Ordinary kitchen food waste is fed into a tank where tiny microbes break it down to produce methane gas. From this uh, fruit waste, I get very nice gas, then very fast also production. And this gas is, can be used for, for five hours. This gas is then fed back into the householder's kitchen. Clean, without any smell and it's completely burnt, no much carbon, no smoke, it's a beautiful system, I like it. Inventive homeowners like Mr and Mrs Potti collect extra food waste from restaurants to make their free gas supply go even further. I collect from the shop, I get some fruit waste or vegetable waste, I feed in them and by morning I'll get uh, full, almost half of the drum and it lasts for four hours. Biotech employs 40 full-time workers to produce the parts locally. It hires technicians to install the plants, which cost around 10,000 rupees or 110 pounds. So far, the company has installed more than 12,000 domestic plants and is expanding its operation to build larger industrial tanks for institutions, which can then be adapted to run off both kitchen and human waste. Their main headache is uh, disposal of waste every day. The collection, transportation of waste is the main headache. This system is the better remedy, especially in uh, the developing and undeveloped countries. The most exciting new development for Biotech is how it's scaling up the potential of the technology to manage waste on a much larger scale. The biogas produced can be used to run a small generator to generate electricity as well as for cooking. At Sri Karyan Market, the waste from its fish stalls helps produce enough energy to run 20 electric lights for six hours. Imagine the impact on cleanliness and health if other markets managed their waste in this way and also benefited from the electricity. Uh, the markets and slaughterhouses are generating a lot of waste. In this type of system, the technology is very simple. To a great extent, the waste problem in this market is controlled with the help of this plant. Sajjo Das understands the potential of biogas and is keen to spread the word. My main dream is that for the installation of domestic or decentralized waste treatment system in each and every houses, each and every institutions, each and every slaughterhouse and markets. 
every house can be converted into a power house a small power house that is my dream